Good morning, Americans. This is your favorite alien here on uh, the morning of Saturday, June 24th, uh, hmm, 2023. Stand by for a special commentary. Well, Americans, I'm sick and tired of CNN saying, oh, and here we go, uh, you know, uh, uh, Mr. Trump, he's the first chief executive to be indicted and put on trial for acts of uh, espionage, serious federal crime trials. Uh, really? Uh, hmm. Uh, hmm. Where does CNN get off saying this? I thought they had better journalists than that and better researchers than that. It worked for CNN. In 1807, I don't know if he was indicted at the time, but uh, in 1807, Aaron Burr was brought to trial for treason against the United States. And he had a full-fledged trial. And by the skinniest of luck, or the people didn't want to go all ahead because, you know, he was the third vice president of the United States. So he's the first executive to actually face trial and serious trial for treason, Americans. Treason, okay? And he was acquitted because the jury didn't want to have that in their conscience that he would be the first chief executive convicted of a federal high crime. Treason. Therefore, CNN, get off your high horse on saying that, oh, yeah, yeah, uh, Donald J. Trump is the first chief executive ever brought up on federal charges. Bah. The first chief executive, because you guys admit that he was vice president. That's a chief executive, too. There. Was brought up against treason charges. And just barely made it by the skin of his teeth in 1807. Because one of the jurors, like what happened to President Johnson in 1868, decided that the Constitution was worth saving. Do you understand, Americans? This is your favorite alien saying, come on, CNN, get off your high horse. Good day.